Hello viewers, this is Tao Too Fast here. In today's video, I'll show you this very handy tool that'll help you test the condition of your brake fluid. This tool I have here is made by the company Kaiweets. It has a very easy to read LCD display. It takes just a few seconds and is able to tell you the moisture level in your brake fluid and whether you need to do a brake fluid service on your vehicle. In this video, I'll show you everything you need to know about using this tool, so let's get started. Right here is the Kaiweets brake fluid tester. Operating this tool is very simple. Right here is the LCD display that will show the test result. You have the power button here and the function button. At the end here, you have the metal probe. To test the brake fluid, you need to insert this tip into the brake fluid for about three seconds. And then the display will show you the test result. To turn this on, press and hold the power switch for a second. On the display, you'll see it's defaulted to dot three brake fluid. If you press the function button, it'll toggle over to dot four. 5.1 back to DOT 3. When you're testing a brake fluid at the bottom of the LCD display, it will show you the percentage of the moisture it detects. Now, if the test result is 0 to 2% moisture, the backlight will be green, telling you it's good. If it's 2 to 3%, then the backlight will be yellow and the buzzer will beep slowly, letting you know the brake fluid should be replaced. If it shows 3% or higher, then the backlight will be red and you'll hear a fast buzzer sound. That means the fluid should be replaced right away. Now while testing a fluid, if you press and hold the function button, it'll hold that measurement so you can remove the probe from the brake fluid and still be able to read the test result. To turn this off, press the power button. I'll be using the tester to test the brake fluid on these two vehicles right here. On my right is a 2017 Nissan Pathfinder with about 74,000 miles. And on the left is a newer 2023 Nissan Rogue with 26,000 miles. The brake fluid in the Nissan Pathfinder is still the original fluid. Anyways, let's pop open the hood on both of these vehicles and test the brake fluid. Now the reason you want to test brake fluid is because the fluid is hygroscopic, meaning it will absorb water if it's exposed to air. And if there's too much moisture in the brake fluid, it will decrease the fluid's boiling point, resulting in poor brake performance. And to find out the moisture content in the brake fluid, you can't tell by just looking at its color. You need to use a tester to test it. Right here is a brake fluid reservoir for this Nissan Pathfinder. And looking at the cap on top, it tells you this is brake fluid dot three. Open up this cap. Now inside here there's a screen filter you need to pull up and remove. Now turn on the brake fluid tester. The default is dot three brake fluid. You want to put the metal probe into the brake fluid and hold it for three seconds. I'm gonna press the function button to hold the test result. Now I want to mention when you're working with brake fluid, do not drip the brake fluid all over your car. Brake fluid can eat through paints, so you want to be careful with it. The moisture content inside the brake fluid is 1.6% and the backlight is green, so actually this brake fluid is still okay. Put the filter back in and close this up. Now let's test the brake fluid on this 2023 Nissan Rogue. Now let's test the fluid in here. Now hold it. And the moisture content of this brake fluid is 1.6%. Put the filter back in and close this up. So I found this bottle of brake fluid in my garage. I've had this for about five years now. And I did use it previously, that's why the seal is open. Now even though the brake fluid is in its original container, over time it does absorb some moisture. So I'm gonna pour this out and test it and see what the reading is. As you can see, the fluid is very clear, but you cannot judge it by the color. Now stick the probe in. Here you can see the moisture measurement is 2.4% and it has an amber backlight and it's beeping, letting you know to replace it. Now since the tester tests the water content in the fluid, with this next test, I'm actually gonna test water right here. I'm gonna pour some water out. Put the probe in the water for three seconds. Here on the display, it shows 3.6% moisture and it's full bar and the backlight is red. And I'll beep at you letting you know you need to replace the fluid. For this last test, I have a brand new bottle of brake fluid. As you can see, it still has a seal on it, it's brand new. I'll open it up right now. I'm gonna pour some out. I'm gonna use a tester and test it. For this new fluid, the moisture content shows 1.5% and it's green, so fluid is good. 
So when you're using this tester, you're not going to get a 0% moisture reading. But if you see the display is green, the flu is still good. If you see amber, then it's time to replace it. And if you see red, then you should replace it right away. So for those of you who like to service your own vehicle, this brake fluid tester is a must-have tool in your toolbox. With the LCD display, it's very simple to use. You can quickly find out if your brake fluid needs to be replaced, and it takes all the guesswork out. This tester only costs $18, and if you're interested, check out the link below. As always, thank you for watching. Thank you for watching this video. To support this channel, remember to click on thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and turn on the notification bell so you get notified of new videos.